Number 16 asks us to combine reactions, in this case, combustion, with gases. Additionally, this question, by giving us the grams of CH4 and the grams of the other reactant, is a limiting reactant question. For a limiting reactant question, first step is I'm going to complete in balance, then I'm going to do an ice chart. CH4 is burned. CH4 plus O2 forms CO2 and H2O. Balancing. Carbon's fine. Hydrogen. Now I have a total of two, three, four oxygens there, giving me two O2 on the left. Setting up my ice chart, I'm going to fill in this chart, in this case, in moles. When it's gases, I also have the option of filling it in in liters, but I don't have that. I'm definitely a lot closer to getting moles. So I have 10 grams of CH4. CH4 has a molecular weight of 16. 10 divided by 16. 0.625 moles of CH4. For the moles of oxygen, oxygen's diatomic has a molecular weight of 32. 25 divided by 32 gives me 0.781 moles of O2. These values both start at zero. Filling in my x's, minus x, minus 2x, plus x, plus 2x. The right side of the reaction will be increasing, the left side will be decreasing. Additionally, I decide how many x's based on what the coefficient is. Now I need to decide which reactant is limiting. So off to the side here, I'm going to divide each moles by its coefficient. 0.625 divided by 1 is 0 0.625. 0 0.781 divided by 2 is 0.39. This number is smaller, meaning the oxygen is limiting. Since I know the oxygen to be limiting, what that means is this becomes 0 at the end. Make sure when you're filling in the ice chart, you fill in all of the rows. Don't just stop when you have what you think you need. 0.781 minus 2x equals 0. This is going to allow me to find out what x is so that I can plug it in here to find the ending value, and here, and here. 0.781 equals 2x, x equals 0.39. Now that I have that, I can plug it in here. 0 plus x is 0.39. 0 plus 2 times 0.39 is 0.78. Over here, 0.625 minus 0.39 gives me 0.234 moles. No one has asked me how much excess reactant I have remaining in this case, but the fact that I got a positive number here and not a negative number means I correctly picked which reactant is limiting. I'm close to done with the question. The question asked me how many liters of CO2 are produced at 1.2 atm and 25 degrees Celsius. These are the moles of CO2. So I'm going to plug 0.39 moles into PV equals NRT. My pressure is 1.2. That's in the correct units. I'm looking for volume. Moles are 0.39. R is 0.0821. Temperature needs to be in Kelvin. 27 plus 273 gives me 300 Kelvin. So now in my calculator, 0 0.39 times 0 0.0821 times 300 divided by 1.2 leaves me with almost 8 exactly. Volume from PV equals NRT is in liters.